in outside Africa now. Prime Minister Scott Morrison says Australia will spend about $28 billion out, of 20, out to 2040 to expand its active defence personnel by a third to keep the country safe in an increasingly uncertain global environment. The country has been boosting its defence spending over the past few years as China looks to step up its presence in the Indo-Pacific region. Last year, it entered into a deal to buy nuclear submarines from the United States and Britain. Now, the planned expansion would see the number of defence personnel rise to 80,000, a level not seen since the Vietnam War. Now, Defence Minister Peter Dutton said it was critical to supplement Australia's capabilities to make it a credible partner of the United States, Britain and NATO. The biggest increase in the size of our defence forces in peacetime in Australian history. This is a significant vote of confidence in our defence forces, but it's a significant recognition by our government, which has always been clear-eyed about the threats and the environment uh, that we face as a country, as a liberal democracy in the Indo-Pacific. Today I'm announcing that we will boost our defence forces by some 18,500, which will take our defence forces to 80,000 in number. Now, this will cost some $38 billion out to 2040. And this is a significant investment in our future force. We have an outstanding defence force. When you look at what's happening in Europe at the moment, people who believe that President Putin's only ambition is for the Ukraine don't understand the history that our military leaders understand. If people think that the ambitions within the Indo-Pacific are restricted just to Taiwan and that there won't be knock-on impacts if we don't provide a deterrence effect and work closely with our colleagues and with our allies, then they don't understand the lessons of history. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.